Hello everybody, Swift here again with another first to first no dungeon run. And today I'm gonna be doing a run with Wilhelm the Fluff, the guy that starts with a bunch of dexterity and uh, intelligence. For uh, items, we're gonna go with the plate mail, that is, you know, we heal on uh, when we get hit and also get resistance and block and health, and also with cooling gloves so we get uh, pickup radius and attack speed. For weapons, we're gonna go with Thunderblade and the Rainbow Catcher, and let's go. Now, the weapon specifically right now, the Rainbow Catcher is this a laser, and its ultimate ability is a multiple laser machine gun effect, and then we have have electricity here with the ultimate being it throws out some swords uh, of course i think electricity is the better of the two but maybe we're gonna need you know range attacks so that stays in the build i got this electrifying the water i love this as a design it doesn't do anything though oh it does it damages normally yep nice although it doesn't say the damage it does so uh there's that i guess but still who cares and if snake is attacking us of course why wouldn't it uh, from these choices, we're obviously gonna go with the Santa Claus, and of course, we're gonna start stacking a bit luck up if we can do so. Let's see what we find. Nature resistance, electricity damage, that's a yes. Block and water damage, that's... Oh, uh, water damage is a bit useless, but nature is good. Uh, resistance is good. Fire resistance, fire damage. Might as well go for this for the resistances mainly, and also because we're still sticking to the bottom two. So as long as we're in the bottom two, it's just raining meteors. Um, like, it's easy mode in general. And now we are, we'll start. Laser machine gun, da 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 I'm not sure how good this laser thing is, by the way. Electrify everything. Let's get a free stat. Nice one intelligence per three uh, per, per second level. We're gonna definitely take that. Uh, I hope we're gonna find the um, uh, the thing that you know. I hope we're gonna find the grind as early as possible. In case you don't know, that's a thing that makes every level up give us one additional point. That's straight up better than the thing we just pull. Already, we should have this. This is it. If this is the starting point of this. So we're gonna take this, 50% of your health on level up, trying to get overwhelming power, and then from overwhelming power, that transition over to the grind. It makes you slow down when you're close to them. Okay, good to know. I need to learn what every element does. By the way, I don't know how much more I'm gonna play this. For now, it's still a demo. Uh, it's a free demo, you can play it too, by the way. Link should be in the description. Uh, but for now, I, I really don't know how much more I wanna play this. Uh, we're gonna skip this. Okay, go, go, go. <laughs> This is uh, completely useless on both, 0 0.1 and 0 0.1, like are you serious? I'm not gonna take things that are not gonna help the build. So let's slash through. I would like to get some fire, uh, air fire item, so I can also get the fire build going. But the most important part is Meteor Rain, da 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 da, and a Machine Gun, nice. It's raining Meteors over there, boom, 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 got him. Let's rotate back to the sword. I still believe the sword's a bit better, if not the best one. Overwhelming power is here. I do enjoy mage armor, but overwhelming power is here. They get now, I got 27 on uh, luck. So theoretically, I should stop rolling into luck. Uh, because at 25, you can get the thing that says plus 20 luck, which is pretty much the only reason why I go for luck first. To get that thing and start getting better items, if you are lucky enough. You see, luck affects luck. Who would have thought? Machine gun effect. Let's rotate back to the sword again. Uh, by using the sword for melee, by the way, I have the chance to get that little, you know, buff. And by, if I get that buff four times, that's another thing closer to completion of the quest. The quest for free items over here at first to first chest. Didn't find the one we wanted. XP gain is the play, of course. Although I do enjoy the soul of the badger, and I'm at 30 index intelligence uh, luck. I should transition over to the electricity resistance and contact damage. Uh, might as well. Mutual resistance and health, definite, yes. Dash damage and electricity damage. Also, yes, I guess. Electricity resistance and contact damage. Uh, maybe I don't want this. Nah, let's go for it, whatever. Make him, make him mad. Make him mad, who cares? In a bit, we're gonna start getting free items anyway, so... Hey, there is a nose on the... Wait, what? The nose actually attacks? I never knew that. What? Okay, first time I'm seeing the nose and also first time I'm seeing this. Sift, blind sift. Classic memes, never stop. Okay, we're fighting two frogs as elites. Man, I'm so eager to see what this game is gonna look like in a month or two. I hope it's gonna be patching. I'm assuming it's gonna be patching, right? I don't think the dev is gonna leave the game to die. Especially now that we have begun playing it. And we got some um, audience here existing. I don't know. I, I'm not talking with the dev to be honest. Dev, if you want to tell me anything, contact me over at Discord. Or comment down below and tell me. Uh, Dev over here, I want you to know that XYZ. I'm gonna pin your comment if I read it. If I see it, when I see it. Expanding, it's 0 0.4, expands 0 0.7. Uh, you know what, we're gonna skip these two. We're gonna go for plus one item and more. Want them to be plus one, all of them. We're gonna become super busted.
with the plus one items. Max speed madness. Let's run back there. I see some XP. One damage after five levels. Uh, we're gonna transition over to health and we're gonna go with this. After five levels, we're gonna get crazy block amount and also regen. I think this uh, sounds good. Opponents become became harder. Good luck. Well, we got this easily. Although, I don't know how powerful or not the opponents are right this specific moment. We got the attack speed. I can actually check and see how good my, the opponents are right now. Uh-oh. I'm not sure if it was a good idea to block it to run in there. Uh-oh. 34 life. Panic. 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 Do I have the revive? I'm poisoned? Hey, how do I get rid of the poison, please? I have one life, and I'm stuck with one life. So what am I supposed to do? I block in. Oh, we found the additional stat, by the way. Uh, do I have the revive? I don't have the revive. I just yoloed in. We might die right here. Actually, I'm gonna heal 50 because that's the thing that we obviously have because otherwise we would not be able to find the grind we just found. <laughs> Literally the thing that we said we wanted. Nice. Get rid of our opponents. Let's maybe try to find an item before I try to open the chest up. Maybe in, in case the quest... Is the quest actually done? I don't even need to item open an item. I'm losing... I'm, I'm missing two hard containers, so that's just not gonna happen in time. Critical damage, electricity resistance, and dash rate. That's good. Especially the dash rate. Neutral resistance is the best thing in the game, and dash rate is also really good. Item quality and nature damage. Uh, I'm gonna take this because we're maxed out anyway. Although there is... No, I don't see it. I mean, there is a difference in flames. Now you can see the flames up to the very top. Here you see them about here. So the enemy health is gonna go away pretty fast. But quality, though. But quality, though. Nature damage is useless, by the way. With this build, specifically. In general, I'm not saying it's useless in general. Okay, let's go with the lasers and maybe some laser beams. Let's run out of here. Ah! I think there was a heart at the bottom left corner. Uh, XP gain on max life. I'm gonna say yes to this. Although there was literally the revive that I previously wanted there. Uh, but obviously I'm gonna go with XP gain if I can do so. Let's continue attacking everything we find. I'm not sure if XP uh, gain... Or not gain, but XP needed actually scales after a while because... Yeah, because I'm not seeing it have room to scale. Unless the coins become smaller. Yeah, I need to pay a bit more attention to some things in this game. Once in a while, just saying. And this guy is poison infused. But only the infusion is what makes him poison. The enemy itself is not poison. Same goes with the enemy in the corner. Like, that enemy in the corner, whatever it is, it's water damage. What does this enemy do, by the way? Like, does he just jump? That's it. Machine gun effect. Definitely leaves poison on the ground, and as far as I know, when it dies, it explodes. I think this enemy just dies on exp um, explodes. Yeah, that, that's it. Like, explode on death is, is its effect. 100 plus damage. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna stay away from that guy, and we're gonna fight him with the rainbow laser. I'm not gonna deal with random hits from bubbles across the screen. There is no reason to go close up anyway. That's why I have this weapon in the first place. Uh, is it not? To have crazy range. Also, now we're checking if coins disappear on their own, and it seems like they don't, so that's good. Good thing that XP doesn't expire for no reason on the ground. So that's something I'm giving props to the death. Opponents behind us. Now, theoretically, opponents still have crazy stats. Oh, wet dog, that's the stat of this character. I could also go for water damage freezes, but I don't do water damage. It says water damage, but I don't do water damage. The only thing that does water damage is this thing, uh, this thing right click, which says special seven delayed beams dealing 100 damage of different elements. Oh, he's fully crazy still. Okay. 12 intelligence, 10 water damage, which I don't do, and 3D water resistance, which I actually do uh, get hit by. So we're gonna go for this. Maybe after 0.8, emit fireball when dashing. Okay, this is decent-ish. 0.4. Gain 12 movement speed and 22 attack speed for one second after dashing. First of all, let's get full health. Uh, dash rate and health, I think, is the play. They're not movement speed and agility. 0.8 on this. You know what? Let's continue. I want the water boots. Nah, let's take them. Let's take this. Let's take this. I want to get the water boots at some point. I'm gonna take them another point. Dash rate is good, especially when you have a blink as a dash. Then it's even better. So is he not mad anymore? No, he's still mad. But when does the mad uh, go away? Maybe when you... Maybe the moment I talk to the next chest, maybe that's when it resets? Resets? Whoa, 85 damage taken there. I just want to check and see and know when exactly the reset happens. This guy's really crazy. Let's push him back off to the left. Bye-bye. Get off screen. Off screen assassination. I'm not sure if the off screen assassination makes us lose anything. Like that I'm definitely not aware of. 
And also now I know that the slimes have explode on death mechanics going on. Which of course we hate in this channel. Yeah, I'm gonna bring health to 50 by the way. And then we're gonna transition everything into luck. Uh, intelligence. Uh, let's go with Berserk on low life. I become powerful. And we're gonna go with Meditation on the next round. Uh, I, if I start fighting that is Okay, is he still mad? Nope, he is a bit less mad now. And maybe the, the second they open the chest is gonna become even less mad. Or is he still gonna maintain the opponent's do damage madness part? Which definitely he is right now. Just trying to push my luck here with if I find the free, didn't find the free, he's still in the damage part. Crit damage and contact damage, that's useless for us. I don't call the health, that's definite, yes. Well, crit rate rate and pick up one's definitely a yes, and now he's super mad anyway, so might as well steal this. Actually, it's not super mad. You see, we have the line here with flames. If I put this, it goes to the very top. And the thing is that I don't care about this that much. So yeah, let's try to maybe not be super maxed out. Although, like, people suggested me to, if he is maxed out anyway, might as well steal from him the last thing. There is no reason not to, but I'm not sure about that, man. I'm not sure about that. Maybe maybe I'm making a mistake, maybe I'm not. Who knows? Um, we're gonna go with the 20 luck of mine 10 strength here, although I'm trying to get the strength going. But the reason, of course, is... Uh, wait a minute. Have I found the up your arsenal? Have I found the grind? Yes, I have found the grind. Uh, the reason, of course, why we go for the luck is because uh, the main uh, the reason why you oh the main reason why you go for luck in the first place is to get crazy good items, and as far as I know, you also get more XP in general, which uh, that that part I might be wrong about. Like that part, I can accept that I might be wrong about, but you definitely find more items. Like that's by definition what luck does. Oh, they better items, not more, better items. Oh no, we're dying. I don't have the revive. Stay away from me. Oh no, 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 no. I'm panicking. Panic, panic. Whoop. I'm I'm death's door right now. And I don't have the revive. And it's raining meteors, and this guy is not going away. No. Still alive, 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 still alive. Okay, upon the region globe. Nice, now we're good. Now we're good. Not training over here. Now there is no panic anymore. I like that I have the damage and the attack speed because of the berserker thing. Let's not forget that that is a thing we picked up. And I own low life and better. I need to get the revive at some point, so that we're not panicking that much. Of course, we're gonna continue scaling our health anyway, so we're gonna become more and more tanky. 0 0.2, are you serious right now? 0 0.8. These are trash! I'm skipping, man. I'm skipping, no, I'm skipping. I don't care, I want ones. 50% regen on the left one, NH resistance. Now, nah, other I'm skipping. I'm skipping if you give me trash. One damage, and why we continue going for health? Yeah, let's go. Let's continue with this. The parents become more powerful and stronger. By the way, my water damage is my dash. So when something does water damage, does X, it's, it's talking about my dash specifically. But I don't have any other water damage. Here we go. Crazy attack speed. Electrify the water. Electrify the water. I mean, I'm playing melee here with a quote-unquote ranged character. I mean, he's supposed to be ranged. That doesn't mean I'm supposed to play him ranged. Okay, emit 8 icicles on combo that deal 30 damage. This is decent-ish. Movement speed and dash damage, not really. Let's go with this. So now I'm gonna start doing icicle... Um, oh, not with this weapon, though. Maybe with this weapon? I don't know. Theoretically, I shouldn't use this weapon for um, using the special... The combo or whatever it's called. Stay away from me. Nice, we got the attack speed. Push that guy off screen. Still don't have the revive, so I'm still in a bit of a panic state. Okay, bless is crazy good, neutral resistance and nat and damage resistance in general. I want tranquility, but this is extremely powerful. Let's see what we get. This is free. Weight and neutral damage. Okay, useless though. Nature resistance and health. This is really good. The 51 health is a lot. Effect damage, dash damage, crit hit rate, water resistance, and HP regen. We take this. This is also godlike. Once again, boss continues making the game harder <laughs> because we're stealing too much. I love the system so much, by the way. I love the system of free items, but harder game. This is this is literally the best thing you can possibly do. That's what I'm almost saying. Make us busted while making the game harder. Never ever nerf the player. Increase intelligence by 25 of your current amount. I have too little to take this right now. So we're not gonna take this. Uh, I will continue going for this. Dash damage and movement speed. I think we want this. I think we want movement speed. Uh, I'm still getting the damage explosions. I think we lost the stat point from the chest there. Do I have lifesteal? I don't think we have lifesteal. I don't think we're gonna gain lifesteal for free. Man, I wanted lifesteal yesterday too, with the lightning of the sword. 
I don't know what's up with the non-existence of lifesteal. Okay, let's continue zapping them to death. Dash through. Uh-oh. Uh, would I like to get this going? Would I like to get the laser going? Yeah, I would like to go. Whoa! Uh-oh. And now I'm in danger territory again. Push that guy off screen. Got him. Off screen him. Heal on block. I'm gonna say yes. That's in general really good. If you're even a bit lucky, let's corner the cloud. Yep, cloud is cornered. Successful cloud cornering achieved. What is happening today? We're fighting a lot of a lot of these um, electricity. Uh, not a lot of electricity enemies. No, I take that back. Ooh, block a hit every 12 seconds. That's good. Of course, hammer a jokester. Nope, we're gonna go with a free block and lose movement speed. But free block is free block, especially with healing, and it's 1.6, so might as well go for this. I don't know. Although there are definitely better shields than that. So maybe that was a mistake. We're gonna see, we're gonna see. We need to build up some items, by the way, so... Getting a free block is definitely an item. Let's go with some lasers. I would like to also transition into a dexterity build. Did I just start going into intelligence? What did I go into, by the way? Oh no, I'm still strength. Uh, we're gonna take this for sure. Ooh, this is also good. We're gonna take this though. One damage and intelligence. Defense or damage? Let's go damage. So we just got 10% damage, plus 3 damage, plus 3% damage, pretty much. As intelligence gives you 1% damage per point anyway, so... Look, with the blink, because the blink is water, I can um, put out the fires. How awesome is that? I love this part of the game, too. Whoop, 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 got him. And we got attack speed again. Let's go over here. Let's go with a bit of a laser gun, man. I want to play with the laser a bit. Oh, found the portal also deals damage at the origin radius, increased by 25%. This, oh. <laughs> First of all, let's go into dexterity, so we get this up to 52. Uh, I'm going to say let's go with the crazy stats, 10% damage resistance and 3% regen. So wait, do I now literally have 20% damage resistance and it's flat out? Because that seems insane. Level, let's see. Dash damage, neutral resistance, 30%. This is godsend. Wow, this is this is godlike. Dash damage, and it's free, by the way. And non-neutral resistance. Oh, we take this too. One damage, water resistance, nature resistance. This is also a yes. I mean, once again, we're making him mad, but... Uh, we're getting so many good things overall, so... I don't know what to say. Let's push this guy off screen if we can. So we don't have to deal with two elites in a moment. Got him, I think. Didn't get him. I guess didn't get him. Still trying to get him. And here are the... Here's the other elite, I guess. We got hit twice. Thrice. We're getting hit a bunch of times. Now I find the... Ah, let's go for the revive. Now's a good chance. Although tranquility is also something I want to build up. Push these guys off screen if we can. Push them off screen. Bye-bye. Elites are toasted. And we're now fighting more elites. Because of what I just... Oh, no, we don't. We're just fighting one more elite. Which, I mean, makes sense. And now we're fighting the nature elite. Of course. Why wouldn't we? Stay away from me, Snacker. Snacker. With the, with the dagger throw. Laser, laser, laser. Uh, epic talents are here, but I would like to get tranquility. This doesn't give you anything at all. Like, at all, completely. Yeah, let's go with tranquility. Sif, what are you doing? You're supposed to instantly pick up the nature ta the elite uh, epic talents the moment you find them. Am I? I can do whatever I want. Ooh -hoo. <laughs> I still believe that Tranquility was the play. Let's see what we get. Fire mod 0 0.7, that's a helmet. Fire resistance, which is 18. This is good for us right now. Let's take this. Let's take this. I'm, I'm level 21. Most of the time we die up at about level 25 to 30. So that's like an indication of how I understand where we are. As there is no visual of where we are in kilometers. If I press pause, there is. Like if I press pause here, you can see how far you are in. Is that actually true? <laughs> yeah, that's not true. I don't know where we are. Yeah, I only see the money. And money is also not a good indication. Yeah, level is the best indication, man. But safe level is money. Yeah, that's true. Stay away from me. The farm is good. I would like to get the thing that says, oh, here we go. What are my results, by the way? Fire is bad. Water is mediocre. Electricity. Electricity and nature are mediocre, too. Let's go with this. HP region after three seconds of not taking damage. Because by taking that, now I unlock the thing that says that I get those effects when I'm low life. And also I get the low life effect when I'm um, when I'm 
when I when I don't get hit for three seconds. Like uh, we have two effects right now that say after three seconds of not getting hit, we gain attack speed and HP regen. What is this? And this is what I said, anger meditation. So Berserk activates when meditating, which meditating, uh, of course, activates after three seconds of not taking damage, and then also activates meditation when berserking. So that means that when I'm low life, because this here says that this activates on 50% health or less, we're gonna be start healing for seven seconds, uh, for seven health per second. So these two combo pretty much. Let's take this, continue going for dexter uh, dexterity here. I think I want 50 dex. So I have a decent-ish attack speed, and then for the rest of the game, we just invest everything into intelligence. If I even survive here long enough. But the way we're playing this and the weapons we're using, we definitely want Dex. Uh, let's see what we find. Woo! Dash damage, useful damage, uh, one damage, light damage, we take this, it's free. Fire resistance, electricity resistance, dash damage, but lose five strength. Uh, this is good, instant enemies take more damage. Weight and one damage, one damage, fire resistance. Do I need 35 fire resistance? Electric resistance is definitely useless. This is so good. Let's take these. Opponents again, double health. Actually, you know what? Let's skip these, as they're not that crazy. This is actually decent. This is a yes. This this is not that much of a yes. It's good, don't get me wrong. 35% fire resistance is decent, really good, but... Let's try to calm him down a bit. If anything, even 7% 1 damage isn't worth the rage. Because opponent's doing double damage, right? Yeah, we would have died right there. Right then and there we would be dead. Uh, I'm gonna take one more so it's 40 and then we're gonna transition over to intelligence. Replace every second fire mob breath into, for water breath. That's actually good with the build we have. Because we're a water build. I mean, are we water build? I'm not really water build. I don't know. Man, the crazy dexterity really shows. Just having crazy dex is, is really good in general. And I'm definitely gonna transition over to intelligence in a moment. Where? Well, to intelligence in a moment. Here we go, let's go intelligence. Uh, let's go this, reduce the cooldown of the revive to 20 seconds, and also damage resistance, flat damage resistance by 20, you get 20% flat damage resistance when below 50% health, and it also lingers, and nature resistance is pretty much done after you pick this thing up, as 30% is already uh, good enough. Now, by the way, in case you don't know how resistance is working in this game, because that's a thing that not everybody is, you know, needs to know, or has to know, to be honest. Um, uh, ten percent, the percent, like when it says ten percent or twenty percent or whatever, it means that you need to take that much more damage to die uh, from that. Like for example, if you have a hundred electricity resistance and let's say a thousand life, okay, that means that you need to get hit a hundred percent more from electricity resistance. What, what resistance did I give example? Let's go fire resistance, okay? So let's say you have a hundred fire resistance and a thousand life. Well, you need to get hit a hundred percent more. To die. That means you need to take 2,000 fire damage. Now, of course, you're not gonna see the 2,000 damage taken because, of course, you will just see the number 300. But that 300, in reality, would have been, um, you know, 600 otherwise, so to speak. Because, actually, is that factually true? I can check this. I can check this right now, to be honest. 77 neutral resistance is 43. Yeah, if I have on something 100%, at the bottom it says your effective nature damage is reduced by 44. If if at the bottom at the top it says 100, then at the bottom it's gonna say 50. If at the top it's gonna say 200%, at the bottom it's gonna say 66. Now you might think, oh, that's diminishing returns, but it's not actually diminishing returns. At the end of the day, you still will increase the amount of damage you can tank, but the, by the exact amount of percent you gain. So it's all it feels like diminishing returns because the number you're seeing is actually you know lower. But uh, in reality, it's just straight up the same. The 20% you gain in the beginning of the game is the same powerful as the 20% you gain later. It just means that you need to take 20% more damage to die. Uh, this... <laughs> Why? Why? Why, game? Why do you have to do this to me? We're gonna skip. We're gonna skip. Actually, 2% lifesteal. Give me this. I'm gonna get the 2% lifesteal. Of course, I would have liked it to be a higher rate, but... You know, 2% lifesteal is 2% lifesteal. And we're doing like 200 damage plus, so this is a lot. Yeah, so at, at 200 damage, 2% is... Wait a minute, I can actually do this math. And now we're 2% lifesteal, we definitely take this. And 10 HP, this is what's really good. We're gonna take the lifesteal, of course. As it's more. So now I have 4% lifesteal. So 4% of 100 is 4, of 200 it's 8. So I heal 8 per attack. Per attack I do. I'm yoloing through there just for the XP and the money. Blank through here so I can push him back into the oblivion. Uh, please stay away from me. Okay, got the attack speed. K 
Okay, that guy off screen. I think he also opened the chest that I never picked up. One life steal. I never have seen this. Neutral resistance. Godlike. One damage. This is the godlike item. Effect damage and dash rate. Yes. And look at this. He is now cooling down. Nice. Portal is more powerful and more awesome. We're gonna go yes on that. Let's go with a double portal explosion effect. Nice, nice, nice. We're doing 800. We have 800 life. I don't think 800 life is enough, by the way. Not even uh, remotely close to enough. But I think as long as I have a decent amount of dex and intelligence, we're good to go. Especially with the damage scaling that we gain from intelligence. Movement speed. I think I want this. I definitely want this. I haven't been told this is one of the better ones. As it's very hard to get damage immunity in general. So, there's the reasoning there. Let's push the boss off to the left if I can do so. I'm trying to push him off. Push him off. Very nice. That was a success. Got some regen. Let's not forget that low life we start healing faster. Now the next two I would like to get is the 10% 10, 10 healing from the epic talents. Wait a minute, did I actually get the epic talents gaining? I don't remember getting the thing that says you find epic talents. Is that true? I definitely got it. Give me a second, I'm gonna pause here. Yeah, I guess I got it at some point. I do enjoy this laser pushing the opponents in the corner. Laser gun! Oh, stay away. Yeah, I don't need to do the laser gun ever again. You can just keep him there. 7, 400. What is this doing, man? This is doing a lot of damage. And now we're fighting Fire from her name is Fire. And of course, play her with a laser because I don't want to be made against her. What are these sound effects? I'm hearing some. Doink, doink. Oh, she has a lot of life. Oh, no. This fight's going to last a year. Am I getting free coins or something? Feels like I'm getting free. Did I? Did I? It felt like I found some free coins or something. Laser gun. Laser gun. I was expecting her there. Yeah, I am getting free coins from somewhere. Something is off. Yeah, well, here it is again. A free coin. Who does that? What, what, what is doing that? I don't remember having a passive that said something about you get free XP every XYZ. Laser gun. Whoop. Stay away. The dash itself doesn't do anything, by the way. Combo. 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 Is that better? I'm not sure if the combo is better than just attacking. I can be as far away as I want, by the way, so... I definitely don't need to do the combo if I can just stay over here and she's not even hitting us. And somewhere around here, she's gonna do her ultimate. And I do like that. I can see where she's gonna go and then I'm gonna be like, right click, da 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 And now she's damage immune, so she's ultimating us. Ultimating us with her ultimatum. The music is so good though. Stay away. I'm level 29, so that means we're very close to the end of this. As at around level 30, level 35, that's where I'm dying. By the way, right now the the leaderboards are busy. Oh! Wait a minute. Since when does she do so much damage? I'm time to lifesteal. Uh, by the way, as I was trying to say, the leaderboards are disabled right now, so no matter what score I get, we're not gonna be able to upload it. It's just gonna be in our imagination. Everything that's gonna have... Whoa! Let's not get hit by anything. Is she also doing double damage, by the way, right now? Is that a thing she's doing? Like, am I, am I still fighting with the cat? I can pause and see, but I don't want to lose my... Uh, the zone effect, which it doesn't exist right now for me because we got hit anyway, so Where is the zone when you get hit? Also, let's not forget that every 12 seconds. I will block the next hit. She does She does so much damage. What is she doing? Stay away from me Lifesteal definitely is not worth it <laughs> Like I thought that lifesteal is godlike, but no, it's not I'm doing 400 damage here per hit and it does not heal me like as like I was assuming it would I, I'm healing more from the block heals you 5% than from what I'm getting from lifesteal. Machine gun effect. Got her. Give us intelligence. Found Bernie. We're gonna go with blocking, of course. It updates. How much block do I have? 42%. Take it. Now I have how much block do I have now? Got her. How much block do I have now? Uh, where is block, by the way? Block certain. Yeah, that's helpful. Anyway, let's go. I'm rotating back into my lightning build that I was. 0 0.9 on the tail, 3 flames on the thing. Or cleansing amulet, 0. You know what, we're gonna go for this. Increase uh, health region by a lot. At this point, we need to pick things up because we're level 30 and the game is about to end. 
if it doesn't end right now. Like, the moment you see the, the letters that say, no, the game is harder, th th that, that moment we're dying. Yep, this is it. Now we're gonna see everything just chasing us down like crazy. Too many mushrooms in the dark forest. This is what the screen that's gonna... The death screen's gonna read. I can see this happening right now. Whoop. Trying to continue level up. Nice. Crit hit rate. That's good. Yeah, the crit resistance, that's useless. Uh, let's go crit rate. Devastating crits or opponents that got critted take more damage. That's some good things that we could... Oh, could have picked up. Let's blink over there. Trying to go close to the... Um, to the elites, but that's such a crazy not good idea. Whoa, almost died. Get the attack speed again. Whoa, 500 damage taken, by the way. Neutral damage, HP regen, dash rate, and neutral distance. That's free and get it. Crit resistance is useless. One damage is good. Contact damage, item quality, weight, and health. Can I take all of them? No, 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 no. One of them has to stay back. Uh, either quantity or health is the one choice, or resistance to something useless and one damage is the other choice. Uh, quality, quantity. You know what? How much more health is this? Can I see? I don't think... <laughs> build a whole dungeon for you. You walk away a bit further. Um, <laughs> you will find great magic items that will probably take, but no, it's never... Let's go this. Let's go one damage. Let's go one damage. And we're dead. I have a revive. Still alive, still alive. Didn't lose the revive, by the way. Still gaining levels. Still XP. Nice. Crit damage, 35. No. Um... You know, we're gonna go here, 25% intelligence of the current amount right now, because this is 8% uh, crit chance, which isn't that much. Don't have a dash, I didn't have a dash for a moment there. I'm running faster. Dash over, and now we're fighting a, uh, a nature enemy. So that's the one resistance I'm not building up at all, but I have enough of it. Push him off screen, if I can do so. Got him. Nope. Did we get him or not? Electricity resistance, and irrelevant. Water resistance, pretty more relevant. Effect damage and contact damage. Uh, I think water resistance pretty much forced. I think water resistance pretty much forced. As uh, not only is it the worst, but we're fighting it right now. 440 something damage here. And also so many opponents do water damage in general. These, these bubbles here are, is, are pretty hard to avoid. Pretty medium. Mediocre to avoid. <laughs> I would like to get the 10 HP region per second from the F Whoa. from the epic upgrades. Blocked. Got the got the HP region. Oh whoa. Stay away from me. No. Uh -oh. If I lose my revive, it's over. Rotating over back and forth. Nature resistance, that's useless. Uh pickup radius. I love that thing, but you know what? I'm gonna take pickup radius and let's start rotating over to deck so I can take this at some point. So we just deleted the HP region idea from our build. But now we have crazy pickup radius. Am I right? Am I right? At least we're not losing XP anymore. So in my opinion... Oh, I, I made a mistake. I didn't pick up the effect damage. Yeah, I definitely made a mistake. <laughs> I didn't pick up the effect damage. Uh, we're gonna go with opponents move slower. Effect damage and contact damage. Let's go with opponents move slower. On dash. So when I dash... The opponents get this uh, slow applied. Let's see what we get. Block and fire damage. Useless to fire damage. Crit hit rate and pick them on. That's decent-ish. We're gonna build in hit and yeah. Oh, uh, so we're not gonna pick this. <laughs> if this happens, we instantly die. 0 0.1 in vulnerability time is good and 20 health is also decent. Yes, let's continue. 20 health is almost too strength. Whoa, 400 damage taken. I really enjoy that the blink explodes behind us. Therefore, uh... From the point I leave and from the point I the origin, frozen enemies have 50% less movement speed and 20% less attack speed. This is good. Fire resistance 46. My fire resistance is trash. We're almost likely gonna die from the fire resistance. From whoa, we literally fire enemy in front of us. We need to get rid of him. Okay, push him off screen. The off screen counted. Nice. That guy's done. And now we're fighting another. Whoa, 350 damage. Okay, at least we're definitely healing. Let's push this guy off too. I heal with 50% health if I actually die. Okay, that's better than healing with... Oh, you just didn't die. <laughs> like, that's the normal version, by the way. And we got even faster opponents. Well, it doesn't matter because every time you blink, they move slower. Nice. Am I a full... Do I have a full build right now? 
I'm doing a rotation around them, trying to blink away when they... Oh, we lost the revive. That was the revive. And I'm spamming blink, running away. Blink. Oh, got a level. Nice. What is this? I never have seen this. Water damage, water speed, and water resistance. This is useless. Uh, we're gonna go with a little bit of everything because this is useless. <laughs> Blink down again. Blink up again. I don't have the revive. I don't have a revive. I don't have a revive. I'm still alive. Still alive. Still alive. Run over here. Give me the chest. <laughs> Block, water resistance, effect damage, and nature damage. Yes, that's really good. Strength, but lose intelligence. I'm okay with this. Ah, no, I'm not. Um, regen, water damage, effect damage, and neutral damage. I mean, I'm okay with meteors. Water damage and effect damage. Effect damage is good. Water damage is useless. HP regen is almost useless. You know what? Let, let, let opponents have less than the crazy speed if we survive here. Uh, oh, do I have the revive ready? Do I have the revive ready? Stop! No, I just lost the revive. Ah, stay away from me. Ah, I want this money. I'm yelling very hard. Uh, let's get the crit chance. Yeah, let's get it right now. Jump away. No! It's okay, though. It's okay. Maybe one of the better runs I've ever done. Ooh, actually, Goldurin is less than my record, and progress is just a smidge more. If I didn't have the opponents running that fast... Man, you know what? At the very end, when you get to the point I was like, at around level 35, uh, 35 to 39... Uh, yeah, at around level 35, I should realize that opponents having 1.5 times more speed is deadly. Like, th that thing is killing me extremely often. If opponents moved 50% slower than what they did, we would not have that issue. Um, also, honestly speaking, if one of the two weapons was a water melee weapon, I also would not have the issue. Like, the Rainbow Catcher didn't really help us in any way, although I didn't really use it that much, but I think the secondary weapon should be a water weapon, so that you can use it to slow down opponents. Like, you attack them once, everything moves slowly, 50% slower to be precise, and then you just beat them. Oh, none of these, yeah, I have them already all. It's seen to the damage meter, Thunder Slash did the most, Portal did the second most, and then Sunstrike did uh, the next most, although once again didn't really use that that much. I was doing most of the lightning and a bit water damage, and I was taking the most neutral damage, as always. And also a lot of water damage, but um, yeah, we still died from too many mushrooms, I told you. I told you this is what we're gonna read. Close the report, once again, as I said, the leaderboard is right now um, completely uh, crashed, I guess. And um, yeah, we'll most likely continue playing this. I really love this game. I'm thinking about continue playing with Fyra. She seems to be the most powerful character with her five fire passives that are really good. Now for what I'm going to use next time, we're going to see. I don't know. I think the best weapon combo is Thunderblade into something of water. I guess Ultra Soaker so you can make opponents slower. Is this the only water weapon? I guess it is. I also haven't tried the matchstick. Maybe that's also good. I don't know. Do you want me to play this more? Comment down below and tell me about it. I'm still thinking. Maybe I'm gonna do one more run and then transition to another game until this goes out of demo version. There are so many games out there that I want to play. I really enjoy this, by the way. Uh, but I just feel like we're pushing towards the end of how much you can do in this. Um, so until they add, like, a new huge patch with, I don't know, five more passives or whatnot. You know what? I have never done a skeleton build. Maybe I should do a skeleton build next. Like, maybe I'm gonna do a darkness build next, and then I'm gonna drop the game. Because, yeah, I would also like to do a super duper zap lightning build, which I didn't really do. Ice doesn't really have... Maybe also full-on ice build. Man, I, I haven't done full-on builds on lightning, water, and um, and this, and, and skeletons. So, next run is gonna be tomorrow's skeletons, most likely. We're gonna try to get every single skeleton-related passive. So, maybe that's gonna be awesome. And then, uh, and then we're gonna decide again after the fact. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, drop a like on the channel. If you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe too. I'm playing this, you know, a couple of days now in, in, um, in turn, in order. I don't know, back to back. A couple of days in... Yeah, I, I, I lost the expression in my mind. Comment down below and tell me about how the expression goes. Uh, and let me crash the game for you now that the leaderboards are offline. Look at this. Uh, let, me, let me teach you a little trick where you crash the game. You go over here at the leaderboard. And as you see, everything is buggy, and the moment you press on your own name, it crashes. Look at the three, two, one click, and it crashed. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and see you guys around.